Oh, no, go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> it's gotta be right. <laughs> That's good. Wow. Hey guys, welcome to another video and we're here today with uh, Glenn and Mr. Jarvis and this car here it belongs to Glenn and this is uh, the new Red Cat Racing Gen 8 Scout 2 is that right? Yeah, Gen 8 Scout 2 uh, Blue Edition um, with the 2.2 wheels as you can see he modified it he got the bigger wheels 2.2s fit on there perfect it looks really close but i don't believe there's rubbing issues he's been crawling with it already and it actually uh works fine uh glenn does it rub with the 2.2s oh yes oh it does but it, these are only 1.9 right 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 so 1.9 rims but the, the tires are 2.2s yes no no 1.9 these are just the bigger super small these are the bigger they look like 2.2s no, no. Oh, okay. Yeah, they actually look significantly bigger than the 1.9s. Yeah, 1.9s. So they're 1.9 large Super Swampers. Yes. So they make two sizes of the Super Swampers? No, yeah. Super Swampers. Because the original, the ones that came with this truck are Super Swampers. Oh, these are super, uh, Boggers. Super Boggers? Swampers. Bo what? What? No. There's a Super Swamper, which the truck comes with, which is a smaller wheel. And this here is a Super Swamper Bogger. Bogger, then. It must be Super Swamper Bogger, yeah. Okay, so Super Swamper. Okay. They don't rub. They don't rub. They don't rub. When I crawl, it's fine. There's never any no rubbing. Oh, no rubbing at all. Okay, that's good. No rubbing is good. Um, so can you tell us a little bit about it? As I see, you got some wheels on here, right? 1.9 wheels, aluminum, bead locks. Yes. They look fantastic. You got with the bigger tires, obviously. Um, you added some lights. You uh, you've been picking up some lights, and yeah. as I can see, you I, added all the lights. I was on here. lucky. You had all the lights that I needed. Other than these actually work, except that I don't have the main batteries, but yeah, all of them are from Amazing RC. Uh, <laughs> cool. Awesome. And uh, on this weekend. very nice. So um, your truck looks fantastic. Uh, you have a couple of things on this truck that I wanted to talk about. Um, for everybody watching that has a Gen 8, guys, yes. there's you can modify this vehicle uh, quite a few different ways, uh, interior-wise. And uh, I'm gonna just let you Glenn here. Underneath. Okay, let's start. Yeah. Let's so start. I'll let you take over there, Glenn, and you let me know uh, what you've done here. Underneath, our good buddy Tom made a skid plate, so now we have the flat. You can also get this. You can get these skid plates, correct? Yeah. yeah. Okay, we have these skid plates, yes. guys. If you need these custom skid plates, yeah. just let me know, and I get so these for you. No more hang-ups. Yeah. This weekend, I was able to put. Uh, it, it's there's a bit of slop in the in the steering. A guy showed on YouTube a way to eliminate a bit of the slop. Yep. So I just modified that a bit to help eliminate the slop. And what is it exactly that you did to eliminate it? You put this top link up uh, here? Uh, no, nope. All I did was a longer bolt and the original bolt. And I just basically made up a little aluminum plate. Oh, nice. Okay. Yeah, to hold the top end together? To okay. It. Yeah, and it, it stops the slop. Uh, anything else in the back, underneath? Right nope. And obviously, I just changed the server. Yeah. So as far as inside now, chassis. Oh we did wow! The magnets. Stealth mounts, guys. So we got the stealth mounts on the body here, uh, w which hold up pretty good, huh? Very good. Yeah. Very good. It could be on a, a ninety; it'll stay on. Awesome. Got the winch from Amazing. Awesome. The Warren. Um, as as you can see here, uh, guys, this is where the battery mounts, right in the center of the vehicle. And uh, this seat here is custom. This is a custom seat. You can actually purchase these seats here if you want to add some interior to uh, the Gen 8. And that's Terminator. He's all chained up, <laughs> the Terminator there, which he looks... <laughs> He looks like he belongs there. And uh, and as you can see on the body, we also have the um, we also have the interior here too, guys. The seat. These are specifically for the Gen 8, guys. 
We have them uh, at the store if you do need them. It's all uh, printed out very nicely. I'm gonna show you if you want to get the matching. Um, see, gorgeous. Yeah, so if you want to get the matching gorgeous. blue, and there's the rear seat as well. So you can actually get these and they fit your Gen 8 perfectly you can also get inside. The red in case you don't get the, the different body colors you can get. Exactly. We can get them in any color that you'd like. You just let us know and we'll actually have it ready for you. Also here, like we got the door handles. Yep. Sunroof. Oh, the sunroof looks fantastic. Gas cap. Yep. Rear hatch release. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Ah, very nice. So, no, it looks, it's, it's all the little details possible. like these yeah. that make it look uh, a little bit more realistic. It looks uh, a lot nicer. Gives it a nice touch, right? Because when you're, you're crawling and, and you have that set up. amazing. This truck is, is amazing. Yeah. It's, it's, it just... Boom. Just like that, go. eh? <laughs> yeah, cool. So how many runs have you taken it out on? I'd say about 10. 10 runs so 10 far? Runs. Okay, yeah. that's nice. And you like the vehicle overall? Overall, it's the best. So yeah. To me. Wow. Better than the axles. Okay. It just looks more realistic in its movements. It looks awesome. It just runs good. I love yeah. it. I love it. Yeah, I love it too. It looks nice. I like the blue that you went with. They come in orange as well, but the blue really like looks really and nice. Body is in case they want to. Yeah, that's right. Actually, we just ended up getting some clear bodies here too. So, guys, if you want to get uh, your own paint. Uh, you know your own custom paint done you can get a clear body and you can post it uh, right over top and uh, yeah you make it your own make it look exactly how you want it to so yes guys um, I just wanted to just let you know that if you do have a gen 8 there are a lot of modifications that you can do to it uh, and a lot of parts that you can buy um, like obviously aftermarket like interior parts that are actually for it and they fit right on a lot of different wheels too uh just overall a fantastic vehicle i definitely got to give props out to red cat racing so guys if you're watching big shout out to red cat racing anybody that's looking for a crawler and you want something uh super good uh well priced as well i recommend the gen 8 if you want to just get into it with a more of a like if you have a budget and you want to spend uh, too much money then you can always look into the gen 7 sport the gen 7 sport is also a fantastic crawler high articulation and they sell for a little bit less as well but i also think you're coming out with the chassis only yeah the actually they're here yes oh. so they just came in they're actually the gen 8 packs so these are just a chassis if you want to build your own yeah, um, your axial stuff wheels mm -hmm. electronics yeah. Anything they want. That's right. It's called the uh, the pack pre assembled chassis kit. So yeah, there's another way that you can do uh, you know custom builds as well. So overall, thank you guys uh, for bringing it in your vehicle and it looks obviously super nice. And uh, hopefully the the whole world likes it as well. The millions and millions of they people. Will. Yeah, they awesome. Will. <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Subscribe. Thanks for subscribing if you are watching, or thanks for watching if you are watching. Or thanks for liking if you're watching. Yeah. Let, okay, let me do it again. And take two. Thanks for watching, guys. And uh, thank you for subscribing if you have. If you haven't, uh, please subscribe. Uh, we're definitely putting up more crazy, fun videos for the summertime. Yeah. All right. Cool. Thanks, guys.